I guess everybody out there knows this gentleman who's seated here beside me right now. He's Everett Dirksen, and he's your senator. Senator Dirksen, could you tell me what is the difference between a Republican and a Democrat? I'm afraid we'd have to devote the whole evening to it. But perhaps I, I could highlight one or two things. One, of course, is the, the insistence on the part of Republicans that uh, we balance up our fiscal affairs to make sure that we're going to have a solvent country. I think, generally speaking, our friends on the other side of the aisle are prone to spend money and go in for new activities when it's rather doubtful whether or not it is good for the country and for the interests of the people because you pile up your national debt, you pile up the interest, you pile up these staggering deficits that we have at the present time, and that spends itself in terms of higher interest rates, higher prices in the stores where people shop, and so the evil effects always fall upon the people back home. That is one real departure between the, the two parties. There are others, of course. Uh, I think it can be said that we still own to the gospel of Abraham Lincoln. He once said that he was a, he thought he was a conservative Republican. And I think that goes for me. I'm a guard variety Lincoln Republican. And when I say conservative, that means to conserve the values, the assets, and the resources that have been builded up in this country and to make sure that we have a good legacy that we can transmit to those who come after. Now, we've been uh, the beneficiaries of a tremendous inheritance in the form of a free country. And that gives point also to one more thing. The Republicans try as best they can to resist the constant incursions of the federal government into the liberties of the people. By that I mean through rule, law, and regulation to subject them to restrictions and inhibitions of one kind and another that are very definitely they're circumscribing their liberties at home. So we can pinpoint it there on the fiscal matter and on the matter of the liberties of the people. Okay, thank you very much. Senator Everett Dirksen, your senator from Illinois.